Oh, the dreaded Valentine's Day. For some, it's like a rom-com fantasy, but for others, it's just another day. Okay, that might sound a little cold-hearted, but you're not alone. Wood frogs also spend the day of love, a little bit frozen and probably hiding under the snow right now. These are wood frogs. They can be found in the prairies and they have a very interesting trait. In the winter, they freeze completely, including their hearts. Well, wood frogs are a really interesting species. When we think of animals that live outside here, right? Most of them try to avoid the cold and they go into deep burrows or in some cases they actually go under the water and overwinter in the water. Wood frogs don't do that. They actually leave the water in the, in the fall prior to hibernation and they go underneath the leaf litter and they try to find a nice cozy place that's gonna stay above zero all winter long. So wood frogs are very unusual. They not only embrace the freezing, but they control it. So they allow some parts of their bodies to freeze solid and that's all of the fluid outside of the individual cells, including the blood vessels are frozen solid. But what they do is they're able to keep their cells themselves in a liquid state. Their heart starts pumping, their blood is solid, their brain go flatline as well. There's no brain waves. Campbell says the process can only happen because the wood frog stores sugar in their bloodstream, which keeps them alive. When they do add all these sugars and then the, the sugar molecules basically then will get released back into the blood and probably go back into the liver and be stored. And then in the spring, they'll, they'll use that sugar store mostly for energy. It's a, a frozen heart, but it's a sweetheart. And when it thaws, again, all of that love, all of that sugar is, is released into the bloodstream. So if your heart doesn't skip a beat for Valentine's Day, don't worry, you're probably still like a wood frog and a total sweetheart. Fiona Odlum, CBC News, Winnipeg.